Hello everybody, it is Tuesday, and if you saw my picture yesterday that I shared, um, inviting you to show up today, Tuesday, and get some more information about it. And I apologize, but my puppies are being a little bit vocal this morning. If you can hear them, they're just barking in the background every time they hear a noise but I'm gonna switch you over so you can see a picture of it and I actually have another I've got a couple blocks I'm just gonna share those with you here we go take a look at that that is hoop sisters you know I've been talking about it it is the hoop sisters splendid star this is shop only you have to get the design um, through the shop that's actually going to be the center of the quilt um, so I've got I'm steadily working at getting some of the blocks sewn together so that I can share them with you um, it's this starts in February so you have plenty of time to jump on board and join us this is going to be done in a Facebook group now the pictures I have are not the prettiest uh, printed out on the printer but you can look on our website and they're much prettier um, but this is just showing some of the the combinations you get brought into um, hoop sisters we have it set up as a Facebook group and the Facebook group you'll be able to post your pictures um, I'll flip back over here a minute you'll be able to post your pictures you'll be able to um, there'll be a class they're going to have live sessions and the sessions will then be recorded and you don't have to download anything it stays right there as part of the Facebook group so if you miss any of it live you'll still be able to um, you know get into the group and see and you'll see col combinations and comments and it's a private you know just a small private group they're going to do a session starting in February and I think it runs like February, March, April. It's four months. Let me see. Yes, February, March, April, and May. So you can do this over a four-month time. Uh, if you need to wait till a little bit later, you can do August, September, October, November. So they're going to run it again. So you can, I believe, um, you can actually be in part in both of them this is something new that we're doing with hoop sisters this year in addition to all of our other classes um, the designer sarah congdon she is the designer so she designed it and so she's going to present uh, we already had the first getting started now doesn't matter if you missed it because it was just a, a getting started video live video it's there in the group it's in the facebook group so once you sign up, you'll have access to it. And it was just talking about things you need to get started. They're going to do five classes live um, within the Facebook group over four months. And the classes, they'll be live. They'll also be there for you to, to watch. There's also going to be 10 pre-recorded instructional videos. So you can tune into them anytime you want. Um, one for each of the unique blocks. So it's divided up into blocks. Um, you'll be able to watch it, you know, one for each one. There's going to be a Q&A thread with questions answered during the live classes. So if you miss the live, they're still going to have it. You know, they'll have it live. You've missed it. The thread with all the questions. So you think of a question, they've answered it already. You have access to all of that and you know as many students as we can put in there so we've got some from our shop they'll be from other shops who knows you might join in the group and find somebody that you know from where you used to live or you know whatever um so they're going to do that twice let me see what else is on is on the paper because i think that's rather you know it's it's important i think it's it's fun i like the design there's a total of a hundred blocks oh my gosh that's why they're doing different ones each month that's a total because some designs like you look at this one that is four of the same block so there's four okay that's four of the same block you can choose what size five six seven eight nine or ten inch blocks the size blocks that you choose 
determines how big your um, project's going to be, anywhere from 49 inch square to 99 inch square. So I picked the six, so mine will be 57 and a half by 57 and a half, and I'm going to show you, let's see, that was one, that's the, the very center, let me see, okay, let me move these, okay, this is one section, so you do one section four times. And you can see all the different pieces that it's broken down into. That's the map that we're going to be using um, throughout the, the month. We even have a color sheet so you can color them to decide what fabrics that you want to use. You only need four fabrics. These are just a few suggested colorways. You can change them up any way you want to. I kind of mixed a combination of the two. And you can see each and every block that you stitch is going to have um, quilting. So you can choose if you want it to blend or if you want it to um, stand out. So these are just a couple more of the colors. Like I said, just giving you, you need four fabrics. You get to pick what you want. If you need help, I'll be happy to help you. But that's one of the blocks. This is one that I did um, this week. This is actually, there's eight, because this is block A1 and B2. So just showing you, and you can take these, you know, just kind of playing around with them a little bit. You can use them individual, you know, kind of individually to make, make a pillow out of. This is part of the butterfly, but if you did it like this, look at that. So you can play with them too. And you can see all of the detail in the background quilting, all of that, so your blocks are quilted. You can even put your backing on as you go. So that's um, there's an option for that, which will be addressed in the group. I worked on some of the borders yesterday. So these are the four corners. Okay, so we just have four corners. But if I took those four corners and sewed them together, look what happens. I have another shape. So I could use that and you could use the designs in there to make a table runner, to make a pillow, to make a lot of other things. So just um, as I make my blocks, I will share them with you and um, encourage you to join us. Now with this and Hoop Sisters, it is um, exclusive to shops. If you want to buy it from Hoop Sisters, you have to wait till 2025 because that's the exclusive one through the shops this year. Now we're also working on the Navigator and that was exclusive to shops in 2023. We still sell them, so we can still sell them. We have a class going on, a sew along, that we can help you uh, with. It's now available online and in the shop. So I just wanted to really um, share that. And I was hoping Mike was supposed to come on today. But if not, I've got an email that I'll send out um, that has... I think it's got basically the same um, same information. Just something I want to share with you guys. Um, we always like to keep you up on things. Uh, beware, you know, beware. Uh, been this week has been a week where there's um, spam going on, and sometimes you're not quite sure if you've done something wrong or if it's really spam. And they send it out there and try to. You know catch you up in things and I'll give you a couple instances one I was working on the uh, meta what is it meta business or something it goes along with Facebook it's the business side of it and I don't know I think I made one little change or I did something well it drew someone's attention out there and I started getting messages from guest number and then there's like five or six numbers afterwards guest number you have violated some copyright something on your website 
um, or on your Facebook and you, it's going to be taken down and if you um, um, have a complaint or you disagree click here never do that never because that's how they get you it's not the message they try to send a message to scare you so I got it and I I didn't click on it I was wondering I thought well because I'd made a change maybe I you know did something what in the world could it have been and I don't have any copyright infringements on there you know anyway then a couple days later I get another one same number second notice then later I get two other ones with different numbers so you know that just draws red flags and I just ignore them you know I said <laughs> I just ignored them then I was in one of my user groups on Facebook and the question came up um, and I think it's a retailer site that group that I belong to and someone asked that same, you know, same thing they had been getting it too and it is nothing more than a scam again it's the click here be careful um, here's another one I've seen UPS or FedEx we have a package we're trying to deliver a package you know we all order stuff so they assume that somebody is going to um, you know be there and um, you know grab you know we all order packages so they're gonna think well you ordered something and you're gonna to bite on it don't don't bite on it okay uh, another one I've seen is where I think this was actually a Citibank one and the reason I say that because it looked legit the A was a different you know they had the logo and everything but the letter A was different so you know all of um, all of those things and then they get into your you know your special groups and organizations you know that you belong to I had one that um, we have you know, have scholarships and we raise funds for scholarships for women well they're sending out a message saying okay you sponsor these women we're collecting gift cards for them again it's all bogus you know always go to the you know always go to the source and ask there's just you know so many things so many scams out there and it really really irritates me when they try to take advantage of um, you know seniors or any you know anyone that's um, not old but a little bit older or not sure just ask if there's any you know any questions like that that we can help you with you know um, let us know but Mike did have some more information he's probably busy at the store I, I'm not there so I don't know uh, but um, he had drafted an email that we'll be sending out to all of our uh, you know customers with some information on it but I just wanted to that's my public service announcement I keep looking over here to see if he's trying to pop on um, yeah I, I don't I don't see and if anybody's trying to send me a message I can't see it either but you know the other thing that happens is there are days when we get a ton of people uh, watching our lives and there are people from all around the world always makes me a little skeptical um, if you ever get messages from someone and I, these are spams that have come through and I try to catch them and once I do I block them and delete them saying you know how pretty you are and how nice you look and I want to be friends and and can you friend me don't do it don't do it um, if someone sends you a friend request even if it's somebody you know check and see if you're already friends because if you are chances are they've been hacked so anyway that's all I have unless somebody's got a, a comment um, Mike we'll try to catch up with him on Thursday we will be live Thursday at 11 I've got some you know see what I can come up with um, some more something fun and details or you know something really cool 
right now it's not even showing that we're live so I don't see any comments so if you guys give me thumbs up or make your comments on our Facebook live post um, I'll be able to see them if you've got questions be happy to answer we do have still have sales going on we are reducing inventory I told you we found stuff anytime you clean and purge and I know you guys do it too you put stuff out there um, yard sales garage sales donations whatever we all do it we collect stuff and then we don't need it anymore well we find stuff we're working on our way through inventory so you know it's the benefit to you is keep watching because there are lots of things out there there's more things that um, as we find them or things that we have that maybe had the wrong number and the number doesn't show up in our um, inventory system or doesn't show up online sometimes we've had that happen so um, Mike does a really really good job with it he works on that um, you know the best that that he can um, one last thing is Kimber Bell's new quilting through the seasons we will have those um, we've got them on pre-order right now I think it's coming out the end of February I think I think it got delayed a little bit um, so we will have those you can pre-order them and the kits fabric kits are sold out on this first run but you know if you're if the fabric kits something that you really want let me know um, and I we can order for the next go round uh, they make me order that stuff so far in advance that I know that their first order is sold out so okay make it a great day go sew something stay warm and we will be back we'll see you on Thursday classes for the week we do have let's see what day is it <laughs> we had tear tray last week and did you see those pictures oh my gosh everybody just absolutely loved the tear tray um, this week on Wednesday tomorrow tomorrow's my boy's birthday they will be one year old tomorrow so we're trying to come up with um, something to uh, to share and to get some fun pictures of them my little wild boys uh, but tomorrow is Stitcher's Garden from 2 to 4 we're doing the first block so um, you know if you haven't signed up you still can if you need the pattern you still can get it you can use your own fabrics we made it all a cart so that everybody could come in at whatever step or version you just want one block um, you want to learn a technique because each one of them focuses on different different um, feet that either come with your machines are available or if you don't have them we'll share show you workarounds so you can still um, participate so that's um, starts tomorrow from two to four Kimber Bell dealer exclusives that's our round pillow you can barely see it but it's back there against the wall behind the green spool of thread um, is Thursday afternoon and then our mini quilt the first of the mini quilt wall hangings yep that's hiding back there too so that's what we have on tap for the rest of this week so I will see you on Thursday at 11